Anu Balam Bikolo Biko. Please forgive me. What you saw truly happened. But the gods bear me witness that I was not myself. I, I don't know what came over me. The gods forbid that I could ever think of committing such a taboo if it was not led against my will and the absence of my senses. I beg you, please. I beg you, Biko, 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 no, Biko, no. Thank you. You know I truly love you. And I love you too. But the gods are not in favor of our love. Because had it been it's another offense, I would have found some reasons to forgive you. But the gods forbid our love. If not, it wouldn't have happened. I can't forgive you. It's, there's no way I can accept it. Nedum, 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 because look, our marriage is in three K market days. Everybody knows that you and I are husband and wife. You can't do this to me now, please. So you're still talking about our relationship and marriage preparation? After what just happened? No. Our marriage will no longer hold. And I don't want to see you again. Ever. Please, please. Can I ask you a question? What is it? Why did you marry Papa? Why did I marry your father? Yes. Why do you ask? I just want to know. You know, bef before any maiden accepts a man's marriage proposal, she must have seen something about him that will make her accept that proposal. So I want to know, what is that thing about Papa that you know that you saw and accepted his proposal? What? Why are you saying all this? Mama, all my life in this house, since I was born, I have not seen any good thing that Papa has done. It is either trouble here, one act of wickedness there, or some sort of evil. What are you saying about Papa? Eh? I want Pago. I want Nagio. Did I call your your name in this matter? I want Mama who went up on your Mind yourself, oh, mind your business. You shouldn't have said such things about your father. Mama, why won't I say it? I'm just asking a question. There's nobody in this village that has said any good thing about Papa. Why would somebody, why would Papa be enjoying people dreading him? Is that how he wants to live the rest of his life? Um, Oluchi, may the ghost of our land forbid you for the things you say about Papa. Mm -mm. Eh? Mm -mm. How dare you? How dare you say evil about Papa? Okay, Mama, Jacobo. Eh, eh. Mbao zukwe no. Okay, Mama, Jacobo. Mama, I cannot be there. That's how I am. I'm no man. Yes, sir, but fetch up. Mato, you pause on. Hey, what then? Check it, look it. Ya no sasu. Mama, come and pound this it's pepper. Okay, Mama, it's okay. 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 Mama, it's Bia, bia, bia. Young woman, come. Uh, what is your name? I'm Onemma, Obidike's wife. Oh, I thought as much. Uh, where are you coming from? 
Now, as you can see, I am coming from the farm. Mm. Which of the farms? The one next to the river. <laughs> the gods have saved you that you are not coming from the land near the Okosisi. Now, what happened? The land near the Okosisi also belongs to my husband. Mm. I hope you are not trying to involve yourself in the land dispute between your husband and I. When you get home, tell him that I, Akonye Wetalo, said he should stop claiming ownership of that land because it belongs to me. He should desist from having anything to do with that land because no physician can cure Ibi, which is older than his age. Hmm. Okay, I will tell him. Good. Nena. Okay, Nene. You don't have to do this to yourself. Huh? You have refused to tell me what you did to this young man. That made him withdraw his interest in you. You waste most of your time. Grieving. And will not tell me what happened even when I plead with you. I will lose my life. May the gods forbid. You can live without anybody. You will not lose your life. You can live without him. You can live without anybody except for the gods. If Nedo decides to break his engagement with you and will not change his mind, then that is your destiny. You two are not meant to be together in the first place. We are meant to be with each other. Even the gods bear me witness that I cannot live without him. And Mama, if the gods truly know me, then they will know that I cannot survive without him. Come down. Don't tell me what happened. Tell me what you did to him that made him take such a hasty decision. Talk to me. I am in the dark. So Akonye Wetter does not want to let the sleeping dog lie. Huh? He goes about looking for people's trouble in this village. And now he thinks that it is my own turn to receive his trouble. Hey! My father Ubaku Zuku might have been a gentle and a cool man, but he gave birth to me, a lion. I am going to go straight to his house now and feed him with his trouble. Oh, Bim Biko, calm down. Biko, don't do anything out of anger, please. Oh, Bim Biko, do you know why? Just calm down. Biko, Biko, no, no. Eh? Oh, Bim Biko, no, do you know why? Hey, hey, hey! And you, woman, for delaying to give me this information on time, your own punishment awaits you when I return. Oh, Bim Biko, Akoye Wetal is a bad man, no. Don't confront him. Hey! Oh, my mama, I'm going to pay you. Oh, Bim Biko, do you know why your Biko is there, no? Akoye Wetal, no gay danger. Where is Akoye Wetalo? Where is that man that said that trouble is his first name? I am here to crown him with it. Hey. Where is he? Come out and face me. Obidike, what is it? What happened? Why are you shouting in my don't house this morning? Don't talk to me, woman, and don't ask me any question. Let Akoye Wetalo come out here and face me. I am ready to give him a cup full of trouble. Uh -huh. Jimmy, why are you? Why is your temper so high? Major Jonathan is very early in the morning. Young woman, I am not here to explain my temper. Let Akonye Wetel come out here and face me. Or oh, is he afraid now? And who is the backing girl that has come to my father's compound to make trouble? Obidike, how dare you come to our house to make trouble? If 
you know what is good for you, leave. Young woman, will you go back to bed and continue sleeping? I am here to see your father, not you. I said you should leave you back in, dog. Leave! You came shut up. Make sure you not go inside. I call you with him. So you are here. You are here! How dare you say that thing you said to my wife? Huh? Listen, let me tell you something. If you derive joy in giving some people trouble, I am here to tell you that I am different. I am a vulture! And you can't eat my meat. You gave a message to my wife, but I am here to confront you face to face. If I ever see your feet close to my land again, I will tell you that my father, Oba Kuzuku, gave birth to a lion. Let me leave you with a few words. And wait till the day that I'll give you action. Fool! Hey! Now in which land? Which land again is he talking about? Mama, you should not be asking about which land now. Eh? Obinike has no right to come to our house and confront Papa in such a manner. I said shut your mouth and go inside. Asengi, go inside. In our puara. Eh? Are you out of your senses? Fine. What is it? I noticed you've been following me. Can I help you? Um, no, you see, I was actually working in my farm and then um, I noticed you. I, I thought you were a spirit, so I decided to follow. But now I can see you. You're actually flesh and blood. You're a human being. No. Um, what is your name, please? <laughs> my name is Oluchi. Hi, Oluchi. A beautiful name. And the gods actually blessed you with Magnificent beauty. Hey, um, I, I'm really sorry. Afam, Afam Bo Obinze. Obinze? Oh, Afam. Are you from this kingdom? I haven't seen you around. You don't seem to be part of this kingdom. I have never seen you around here. Where are you from? <laughs> um, you see, I get that a lot. I'm actually from this part. It's just that I spent part of my childhood in my mother's clan. Uh, so it's understandable when people see me and call me a stranger. You have seen me. Mm. I am not a ghost. Mm? Mm. Besides, I have something to do in the farm. I need to harvest some farm produce. Oh? Oh, so I draw. Go back to what you were doing. Okay. You need to see cable, you know? I'm going to see cable. Oh, the cable. So why are you saying this? Huh? Why? Nedu Bikunu, talk to us. We are your family. Uh -huh. eh? Much as I know, Nenna is a good woman. Even if she did something wrong, we are all human and we are liable to make mistakes. Forgive her, oh Bikunu. Eh? Tell us, what, 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 what went wrong? Mom, my dear, I am your mother. We are all family. Mom, please, 
If there is anything that happened between both of you, you have to discuss it right here now with your sister and I. We will help settle it. Okay? For all I know, Nena has always been a good girl. So I don't understand this sudden change of mind. Nena is a very close friend of mine. Since the proposed marriage, we've all been happy. She's been part of this family since you people said you were going to get married. Please, don't let the enemy come in between both of you. Be cool. Tell us what it is. Let us sort it out. I'm sorry. I can never marry Nena. Why? Why? I okay. love her. Uh -huh. I love her so much. Can you miss you? But the girl forbid our love. That's why I can never love you. Eh? Off you him. Her name is Chinasa. She is just too loose. This is my third time of seeing her wallowing with different men inside the bush. She is just too loose. Hey! Come, come, just go, let's go. Let's go. Akonye Wotel, what have you come here to do? How dare you tread on my land? Listen to me. If you have come here for any trouble, I will give it to you. <laughs> Obidike, the son of Obak Uzuku, I admire your strength. And courage. You are not anything like your father, but you everything like your grandfather who died before his time. But let me tell you, wisdom demands you know your limits, know what battle to win, and which one to avoid. Akonye Wete, listen to me. You're nothing but a mere mortal. Deal with you here and now, if you dare me. <laughs> of course, you are full of strength. But let me advise you again. A child who does not know what killed the father. What killed the father? Shaki him. I will not stoop so low to banter words with you. But let me leave this piece of advice. Don't go into the river if you cannot swim. Good day. Pa! I shall wait for your worst. There's nothing you can do to me because I am not afraid of you. Rubbish. Anna, 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 we be on a for. Get out of my land! Get out! Let me, let me, let me see you close to this my land again. I will use this matter to cut off your two legs. Big fool. And I will be no tough for.
Eita! Mama, what happened? Eh? What happened? And you have been out of sight for too long now. What is the problem? I had planned to come and see you. I was even saying that after coming back from the farm, I'll come to your house and see you. So that we will talk. Tell us, what is it? What happened? Now that you're here, let's talk. Oh? Mama, I'm in trouble. Nedu has rejected me. Mbamba. Nedu, my own son, he cannot reject you. Tell us what the problem is all about. Eh? What's happened? Just tell us. See. What is it? Nina. Eh? You can talk to us. We have asked Nedu. He's not saying anything. I don't know what must have led to him calling off this marriage. Bikonu, talk to us. Let us know how we're going to sort this out. Yes. Eh? Hey, Obin. There's something I want to discuss with you. Oh. Is that about Akoye Water? What about him? Obi. Hmm? Please. Biko. I want you to avoid that man like someone with leprosy. Everybody in this kingdom knows him as a bad man. That man is evil. Please. So, what are you talking about now? Do you want me to be scared of him? No, I, I didn't say so. I want you to be careful with him. I mean, I want you to handle him with care concerning the land disputes we have with him. I suggest, instead of this constant confrontation and quarrel, why not just take the case to the Igwe and elders? Let them look into it and settle it. Besides, everybody in this village knows that the land belongs to us. So I believe they will settle it well. Please. Okay, okay, there's, uh, there's no problem. I have heard all you said and that. Uh, I am going to do exactly as you have advised. Hmm. Hmm? Again. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, let me feed you. Let me feed you. Let me feed you. Hmm. Let's go, okay. Ewo! Alu! Ewo! Nedu! Evil has happened in our land. It has happened. It has happened. Gods of our land. Why did you let this evil happen to this great our land? My eyes have seen my ears. Hello, man, oh, boy, I... It's Nena. Nena did what? I saw her in the bush, hanging on the tree. What? They rubbed her to her neck. My Nena? Yes. Yes. yes! yes, yes, she's in the bush. Now they are going to the tree. She was darkly. Nena? Yes, Nena. Yes. yes. I got a home with Nena. Nena. Nena, her body. Where? In the bush. Now they are going to the tree. Ah! Please talk to me. Eh? Tell me what happened. Because I know that whatever happened that made you take that drastic decision is responsible for Nena's suicide. You love that girl too much. Something must be really wrong. Talk to me. Hi. Please. Talk to me, Bikon. Silence is dangerous. And it will hurt you if you don't talk, if you don't share with anyone. Become one name, talk to me. I don't want to happen to Nena to happen to you. Become. Eh? It all started as a rumor. I never believed it. I could not imagine it. 
until I saw it with my very eyes. To your father because of Otuk Lodge. Otuk Lodge, which is sold penny penny at Ama Good Evening. Is that why you want to shoot your father? And a Jiwanya to bed is your one name, Melawan, your name, Melonia Diam, one your boom manacala, on your rat, Ibia rat. Is that why you want to shoot your father? It's not worth it, my son. Shoot me and you will rot in jail. Ganga, Gamburoka. Shoot me. Why? Why? It's not worth it, my boy. Eh? What? You, you mean this is what happened? Our father is a cause. I can't believe this. He must have charmed her. I understood that Nina did not choose to sleep with her father by herself. She was obviously bewitched. Hmm. But then there was no way I could continue with the relationship or go ahead to marry her. The gods must have placed a curse on us by giving us such a man for a father. I, I still can't believe this. Hey! There is woman with heart of darkness. Your face is not familiar. Um, nah, I get that a lot. But the truth is, I am actually from this part. Um, I know your name. I asked questions and they told me your name. Oh, so what else did they tell you about? Uh, well, they told me that you are Olichi's younger sister. Hmm. Yes. <laughs> tell me more. Oh, um, Nyonya Nacho. Just the right person I'm looking for. <laughs> yeah, I was just asking your sister after you and then um, all of a sudden you appear in your beauty. So you've been looking all over for me? Yes, what I've been for? looking all over. Um, I will tell you, but um, where are you going? <sighs> I am going to the market. Okay, uh, let me accompany you to the market. Care. Yeah. You want to accompany me to the market? You want to join me and haggle prizes with other market women? I will do it with all pleasure. Oh no, it's okay. Let's go. This is my first day working with you side by side and it doesn't feel as if you're a stranger. It feels as though I've known you for a very long time. <laughs> the gods are bearing witness that we must be together, that we must remain together. But well, permit me to say that uh, it's actually love at first sight. <laughs> <laughs> you have a way with words. And um, you talk about love as if you already have mine. 
Well, I only speak words according to the wishes of my heart. Very well. I hope your wishes come true. I hope so too. But unfortunately, this is where we part ways. Thank you. No problem. Mm. Let me help you. Take no, no, this. no, don't worry. I have both of them. Oh. You can Lada. carry them? Yes. Nice to see you off a bit. I am fine. Mm -hmm. so, thank you for your time. Uh, when shall I see you again? Um, you said you wanted to tell me something. Um, yes. Thank the gods you remembered. Okay, let us meet under the Oji tree. The one beside the Upudarawanmi tree. Onekedi. After some rice. Uh, I'll find it. Okay. Alright. See you. See you too. Bye. I'm going to do it, do you see K, no? A child that must dance through get must first know the move of spirits. The leaf knows the pastor, the pastor knows the man who tied it. Hey, well, hey! Obidike, the son of Akuna Uzu. You brought a challenge to my house. I stand on the great shine of Olukulu to accept the challenge. And today I bring destruction upon destruction upon destruction upon destruction on you. You will destroy yourself by yourself by your own hands. Everything you have will contribute to your destruction until you'll be ruined and finally destroyed. Shrakakada Shimbamba! See that you wanted to go and urinate. When you now came back, your behavior changed. Eh? Uh -huh. Is that why you wanted to force yourself on me? Eh? Uh? By tradition, I have right over your body. But yeah. I never wanted to force myself on you. I wasn't hard on you. Nevertheless, you have to cease from talking to me in this manner. What is wrong with you? Go, 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 go. Come, let's go. Continue. <laughs> Leave me alone now. What is it? Is it by force? Leave me alone. Michael will get back home. Nemma! It was well deserved, don't you think so? Of course I think so. <laughs> Look, I could have waited longer with all pleasure. I have waited all my life for this moment. So certainly, the wait is well deserving of you. Hmm. You have a way with words. You make me feel needed. Aborigine, hmm? like I said before, the words that I speak sprung from the wishes of my heart. Hmm. Tell me more about these wishes. I yearn for the soothing words from your mouth. Apologia. Let's take a walk mm. while I search the deepest part of my heart for those soothing words. Mm. Just for your listening pleasure. I've spent most of my time today with you and it has been 
very fulfilling. I feel the same way too. And your body? The body so close to mine feels really good. My body? What about my body? You know you have an amazing body. The gods took time to mold you and they gave you the perfect shape. Well, eventually, this body of mine will belong to a man and I'll have no power over it. Truth be told, I pray to the gods that someday I want this body of yours to belong to me. I cannot wait for that day to come. Mm. I would cherish and adore it. You have spoken to me today at length about how much you love me and how you want all of me for yourself. And I believe they're true words. I am glad my words were well received. I would like you to meet my mom. Yes, I've told her about you already. You did? Yes. But first, I have to go home. I don't want them to start searching for me. Today has been the most amazing day of my life. I can't wait to make you mine. Surprise to see me and Mazi Akoya Water. Anyway, if you must know, he is my love, and we have decided not to hide it anymore. Nema, have the girls struck you with madness? Eh? What's the meaning of all this rubbish that you're saying? If you listen, you will hear me well. I am no longer your woman, as in, like, henceforth. I belong to him. Thanks. You wicked man. What have you done to my wife? I am not your wife. Are you deaf? And if you must know, this my four months pregnancy belongs to him, not you. Will you cease from this abomination that you're uttering from your mouth? I'm not done talking of. You see that land? Stay away from it. Stay clear from that land. Nonsense. I want where are you going to? Where are you going to? There is woman with heart of darkness. He's so powerful. He's so evil, he's so wicked, everybody beware. Abidike, you killed your wife! Youths, please, I, I crave your indulgence. Just listen to me and hear what happened. I didn't do this with my clear eyes. It was an evil man that caused all this problem. It's a lie, I saw you when you murdered your wife. Yes. There is woman with heart of darkness. This is an abomination in our land. Hey, be hey. What madness drove you into doing this to yourself? To bring a cause in our kingdom. Hey. 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 
Adikwewo. This is strange. And it has never happened in this land before. This kind of thing has never happened in this village before. It has never happened. No, not even the entire kingdom. How did it happen? According to the story, madness from the gods moved him with evil rage. And he killed his wife with a cutlass. Hey. Now, ran off to the bush where he hanged himself. Hey! I'm not going to get out of here. Mama, Mama. Is it not going to be here? Let us look into this matter. Are you sure Papa's hand is not in this matter? Remember he had a disagreement with Obidike concerning a parcel of land. That's exactly what everybody is saying. Hey! 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 hey. 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 Mama. Oluchi. What is it, Mama? Eh? Why are you crying? Eh? Bikonu. Oluchi, talk to me. Can someone talk to me, please? It is the news about all the BK and his wife. <sighs> Mama, Ebiakwa. So you mean that you are crying because of that man that murdered his wife? Eh? Did he not deserve to die? See, Obidike was an arrogant man. And every mother deserves to die. Not to talk of that man that hung himself. Hey! Nobi? Nobi? Where are you going with those bands? Maybe what is happening? I have succeeded in building my own house down the road. Okay. Huh? I'll be settling down there. Huh? Nedu, you mean you have been building hot for yourself all this while? How come nobody knew about it? Yes, Mama. Mama, I do not want to put my trust in you. Bearing in mind what happened to me in the past. Mm -hmm. so bad, though. It is okay. It is your choice and we'll have to stick by it. I'll escort you to know where your new abode is. Mm -mm. So would they? Yes, I don't understand. This is your father's house. And you are the only son of this family. This house is your inheritance. You are not supposed to leave your father's inheritance. Mama. Mama. Mama, I am not running away. Neither am I deserting my inheritance. My just I have my own house to live in now. This is still my house. This is what you want as well. Hey, my name. Hey. Huh? Papa, I'm not. Uh-huh. Papa, Papa, I will, sir. Papa, I am living for the new hut acquired by the square. Hmm? I, I, I don't get it. I mean, there's a difference between sleep and rest. Is it that you are wired or you built? Papa, however you choose to put it, we are still saying the same thing. Mm. Mm. Anyway, you have taken a decision which is unstoppable. And you are just telling me. That's no problem. But um, you will get my goodwill message soon. And I just want to know. This is definitely not ordinary. Yes. Everybody knows it is not ordinary. Yes. Who does not know that anyone who has a disagreement with Akoye Wetalo usually ends up dead or frustrated? Listen, the problem with Obidike was that he did not know his limit. He should have known that his youthful energy and arrogance is not a match with Akoye Wetalo's witchcraft. Witchcraft, that is the right word for it. 
You see, Akwen Watal is a wizard. Even the chief priest of Ogugu fears his handshake. <laughs> you see? You see? According to what I heard, Akoye Wetalo traveled across seven rivers and seven mountains to import his gods and his powers. Therefore, the gods of our land are mesmerized by the powers of his gods, and the medicine men of our land stand no challenge with him. It is said that only a man who has gone to Aaron can tell how many rivers one has to cross before reaching Aaron. And the secrets of Akoye Wetalo are far fetched from the medicine men of our land. Even the gods of our land fear him. As a matter of fact, Akoye Wetalo has no Dibia he consults. In fact, he is a Dibia himself. Such a man should be feared by all. You see? That's what you are saying. This is a man that everybody needs to be scared of. Honestly, when he passes through this way, look for another place. Hey! <laughs> surprise, surprise, surprise! <laughs> I know you are surprised to see me with this boom baby. <laughs> My wife, do not be afraid. I am not about taking another wife. Her name is Chinasa and she is Ntanta Madu. She belongs to our son, Nedu. <laughs> Papa, yeah. you are full of surprises. <laughs> you are welcome. Huh? I'm sure my brother will like you. Ah, thank you. <laughs> thank you. Yes. Wait a minute. Does my son know about this marriage arrangement? And no, no. Does it matter? Eh? If your son is wise, he should appreciate my kind gesture of arranging for a beauty queen for him as a wife. <laughs> That's the important thing. Can't you see how beautiful she is? Look at her, oh my God, Dele. Look at the, 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 the two of your Romango mangoes on her chest. What else do you want? I mean, she is so deserving for our son. What I want to know is this, Nai. Does my son know about this marriage arrangement? Bia, Nne. Mama, do you know my son? Um, yes, ma. I mean, who does not know the son of the most industrious man in his That's village? That is not what I mean. Does he want to marry you? Um, um. Uh, uh, don't, don't, don't bother. Don't bother answering her. Um, Nkem. Papa. Biko. Take her to me. Okay, Papa. Your brother. Okay. Eh? Tell him that this is what I meant when I told him that he would get my goodwill message. Eh? See how do very weave. Eh? But go to look here. Eh? And a joke at all over. Seems he's not at home. Mm. I'll wait for him. I can't. I can't go. I'll wait. Good. No problem. Okay. Um. You're so lucky to be chosen by my father for my brother. Thank you so much. And I'm so glad you loved me at first sight. I don't have a choice. You're my father's choice, so I have to accept you. Thank you. Thank you. Um. I want to ask you something. What? Do you think your brother will accept me? <laughs> that one. You don't have to bother about that, okay? You are a woman. If he does not like you, you will make him to like you. Or do you think you can't do that? Of course I can. Why not? <laughs> At least I have everything in my place. That's what I'm talking about. Okay. <laughs> You're so endowed. My brother doesn't have a chance to love you. Okay? 
Um, we have to go now and come back in the evening. Maybe by then he'll be back from wherever he went to. I'll wait for you. Don't worry. I'll wait for my husband. Are you sure about this? Okay, no problem. I'll be safe. Let me know when he's back. Okay. All right. Thank you. Bye bye. Bye bye. You are beautiful. You are indeed made of beauty. My son lacks sufficient words to describe your beauty. Oh. <laughs> Please sit down, my daughter. Sit down. <laughs> sit. Thank you. You are welcome, my daughter. Thank you. Get her something to eat. No, 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 no. I. I don't want anything. I'm not. I don't have the appetite for. I don't have the appetite to eat anything. No. You don't have to say that. You have to learn the tradition of this family you are about to be part of. Yes. Okay, Ine, I'm sorry. I will take whatever you offer me. Good. Get her something to eat from this house. Hey. How long have you known my son? Uh, not too long. Um, and do you love him enough to be your husband? Ne. Pobin says he's a very good man. He has a good heart. And I thank the gods they made our path cross. You have answered it all. Who are your parents? My mother is Adora, daughter of Nanyelugo from Umuokwe village. And she's married to Mazia Kanyo Hotel. So, Akonyo Wetalo is your father? Yes, ma'am. Too long. I was trying to roast the cup. My name is Chinam, sir. Your father sent me to you. Oh. He sent you to come and do what? <clears throat> um, he, he sent me so you will marry me. My husband, I am the providence of the gods for you. Trust me, we are going to be very happy together. You are no more. Turn your face to where your back is facing and leave this place at once. How can you sound like that to your wife? This is not fair. Why? You are not my wife. I can never be your husband. Now go back to the person that sent you. I'm sure he has plans for you. You are the plans that he has for me. How can you reject me like this? You haven't even taken time to look at me very well and you're sending me out. My husband, look at me now. I have all it 
takes. All. You have everything it takes to be your wife. I am a pot full of honey. Stop. Take your hands off me now! I'm your husband, right? I'm your husband. Wait for me. Eh? Wait. No, 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 no. You should have waited for me to break that stupid pot of honey. I'm off here. Let me see your leg here again. Julius, ah, my sister. Jinasa, why are you sweating? Is someone after you? Jinasa, in this kingdom. <laughs> you know it's not possible now, eh? In fact, I was in a hurry to go home. Let me give them the good news that I have. <laughs> Interesting. <laughs> What is the good news? Can you please share it with me? And my sister. I wanted to keep it a secret though. But since you're my friend now, you know that. Okay, please. I am getting married to an industrial soul of this country. <laughs> this is good news. I'm telling you. Please, who is the man? Do I know him? Of course you know him now. Every maiden in this kingdom knows him. No one to marry him, but he chose me. Oh, Chinasa, yes. then tell me. Let me know if his name will ring a bell. Please tell me. I want to know. His name is Nedu, the son of Mazi Akaunyi Yitali. <laughs> My dear, I'm so happy. <laughs> this is good news. I am happy for you. I am even happy for myself. <laughs> In fact, you know, I can't even wait to get home. Let me tell my parents that somebody is coming to get married to me. <laughs> oh. God will help you. God will bring your home for you. Mguan oh. Thank you, my we'll see later. No. This can never be. Not when I am still unmarried. <laughs> My Nedu can never leave me and marry you. No, he can never be lost. <laughs> Obise's mother found out about Papa and has refused to give her consent. Hey. What did she say? She didn't say anything. Her countenance just changed as soon as I mentioned Papa to be my father. Hi. <sighs> what about Obinze? What was the stand? It doesn't matter. When what concerns the mother is her son's safety. This well. I think you need to listen to him. It matters what he says, despite what his mother thinks. There's no point. There's no point hearing him out. Let's put yourself together, okay? Please go. You'll be fine. You'll get through this. Okay? Well, if you want to share my heart with me, I'll be glad to have you around. I'll be glad to share your heart with you, but I don't think it's the right thing to do. But I can stay a while here. Good. But don't worry, you'll get through this. You'll be alright. You're my sister and you're very strong. Mugo? We just have to go. Shall I watch you? I must tell you, there's a new development. You won't believe it. 
What did you say? What happened? Who else? If not our father. What has he done again? Don't worry. I'll tell you later, okay? For now, you just need to relax and rest. Yes. I know. Nice. You're a good cook. Thank you. And <laughs> mm. <laughs> because who did you say you are again? Ah, uh -uh. Oluchi. But I've told you before. Let her answer. I was not talking to you. Can <sighs> answer your question? I'm Chinedu's wife. You are Chinedu's wife. Yes. How? Since when? How? Your father found me suitable for him. In fact, I'm the best wife for him. Mm. So what are you doing here? Hmm? Why are you not in your so-called husband's house? <coughs> or you don't know the way to his house? Um, I, um, 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 um. He fell all day, Meg, um. Are you not ashamed of yourself? Look, let me tell you. My brother will not marry you. Nedu will not marry you. I will not even support that motion. If you know what is good for you, go and meet that person that brought you to this compound and find out what his plan is. Because if that plan includes making you a second wife, then Because this house will not contain you and I. It is either you go with your head or you move out with your legs. Choose one. I don't want to be second wife to anybody. It's Nedu I want to marry. It's Nedu I want to marry. Will you shut your mouth? If you know they make it, one more day, Kagi, if the plan of the be mad. Hey, 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 let's go. Ah, now, stop! What am I doing this? Damn it, you're not so arrogant. Am I talking to you? Uh, leave her. Leave her to wind her mouth. Ono, ba. Ekutos, ono, kube. Mama, ashire. Leave her. You think? You can drive her away. You are now do togo no onyo of amudo. Drive her away, let me see. This house now belongs to you. You are the only person who has a say in this house. Let me see how you will drive her away. No problem. I won't stop you from staying. You can stay for all you want. Stay. But let me tell you, if you stay here, your stay is in vain. I don't need my hand in here. Why does she hate you so much? Uh, don't, 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 don't mind her. You see, this, this, she's a mad dog. Unfortunately, every mad dog knows the owner except this one. This is your house. Relax. Feel free. And you have got what it takes. And a you for ganga. Feel free. Flaunt it, you have it. See ya. Uh, mad. My brother will marry you. You are my sister in law. I already love you, too. I already love you, too. Don't worry, my brother will marry you. I Don't know. mind her. This is your house. Chinasa, you know, this is where you belong. Eh? My sister in law. This is your house. This is your house. Okay? 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 My son, it is true I overreacted, but you don't have to blame me. You must not blame me after my experience of losing four sons and my husband in the cold hands of evil. Son, you are all I have. And I cannot allow you to endanger your life whatsoever. No! I am invulnerable. Akonye Wetami is a powerful wizard, that I know. But you of all people should also know that I am beyond human destruction. Yes, son, you are right. Yes, 
You could be vulnerable if nothing is done. And that I will not allow. I cannot take chances. Do you ever put into account my pain? This pain still lingers. Notwithstanding all my mother has done to initiate you into becoming the son of the goddess of our way. Thereby making you indestructible by humans. There are these chances that you could be exposed to danger. Son. You can still be exposed to danger. Yes. Mama, your fears are justified. But I need you to take into account my happiness. What is the meaning of life? With all this protection from easy wine, great pieces of Akimiwe without my happiness. I love what you all achieve very much. And I want you to understand that the fear of her father cannot abate this, the feelings that we share. you been? I have been looking out to see you. Oh, well, I have been very busy with farm work. I hope all is well. Um, yes, all is well. Um, my reason for looking out to see you bears a heavy burden. Okay, I am all ears. Obize, I care about you. Thank you very much. You're very well appreciated. Um, have you seen your sister Oluchi, please? Where can I find her? I see. I believe she's the one you're looking for. Oh, yes, um, she is. And thank the gods I found you here. You will make my walk into the village a very easy one. Let's go. Well, I do not know how we're going about Okay, I, I guess I'll find her when I get into the village. Oh, baby. Obizu, I have feelings for you. I can't hide this any longer. I have tried as much as I can to suppress the feelings. But I can't. Um, Inkem, it will do us. A lot of good if you explain to me what you're trying to say. Obinze, I have feelings for you. It boils in me like a wildfire. Um, Nkem. I do not mean to disrespect your feelings for me. But I am sure that you know that your sister and I are bonded in love. I'm very much aware of that. But I believe I stand this chance of winning your love. Don't say that. Don't ever say that. Okay? Make effort to be the master of your feeling. Don't be a slave to it. Please. Think about what I said.
My mother apologizes for her reaction. Come here, dear. Her fears are justified. But she still believes in our love. My tears were not for your mother for not giving her consent, but for my father, that who has brought me nothing but shame and pain. My love, cry no more. No. I fear for you. I have witnessed the evil perpetrated by my father, even to his own blood. If anything happens to you, I don't know how I'm going to handle it. Nothing will happen to me. Operiche, nothing will happen to me. I have heard about your father, Maziakonye Wetalo, and the power he wields, but yet I'm not moved. I have prayed to the gods that nothing will happen to you. I was afraid I was going to lose you. And I'm sure they heard your prayers. Our meeting was predestined by the gods. Our love has come to stay. Alright? Come. Let's take a walk. I find so much pleasure walking side by side with you. I have craved for your words. And I'm glad you enjoy listening to them. Nemuju kodo monke gikam gabo. Namuju kodo monke gikam gabo. Nakae melu mala. Nkem, where is Mama? Has she come back from the market? Not yet. I don't know. Oh. Uh, Oluchi. Um, did you see Obinze? Um, um, he was looking for you when I ran into him on my way to the market. Oh. Oh my God. Found me. Um, Oluchi. Oh, didn't he tell you that he saw me in the morning? I'm sure he forgot to mention that to me. Um, um, I want to say something. What is it? Um, um, oh, give me. My, my heart goes for Obinze. Obinze. Is it again? Si, um, Oluchi. Since the first day I met him, I've been longing to be with him. So I'm begging you in the name of the gods to please spare his love for me. <laughs> hey! Are you alright? What gave you the boldness to utter such irritating words to me? What? I'm begging you, sister. I bared my heart to Obinze. So I believe if you would consider my plea, Obinze would have no choice but to reciprocate my love. <laughs> hey! My sister has gone mad. Look. Okay. I don't know what the problem is, and I don't care. All I know is that I am not going to respond to you so that the madness that has overwhelmed you will not come upon me. So to walk over I'm not mad. Hey, Willie! Tatam, you got me 
need it. Just, just have a, a sip. No, have a sip now. No, Papa. Huh? I have no appetite for fine wine. Ah. Your countenance spells sadness. You know you are the favorite of all my children. So I know where your heart is bitter. What is it, my daughter? What troubles you? Papa, I'm trying so hard to suppress the feelings that hurt my heart and inflicted sadness on my countenance. But I'll be fine in no long time. <laughs> bam, 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 bam. You don't need to suppress the feeling as long as it will ensure your happiness. Kedi, what is the problem? Kwa godri maako yi bon suba. Kwa ya pisi se kam fugodi vado ya nemi. Papa, my heart craves for the heart that has interest in Oluchi. It breaks my heart that I cannot have him because he has chosen her over me. Is that so? Hmm. Okay, this young man you talk about. Does he know that you have you are not some sort of feelings for him? Yes, Papa. I accosted him with my open heart. But it seems his heart is already attached to Oluchi. And when I let her know about my feelings, she tends to appear inconsiderate. Hmm. So so what is his name? He bears the name Obinze. 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 You know what? You don't need to bother your life craving for his love. I will do everything within my purview. I'm giving you assurance, double sure. Okay? You are desired to be accomplished. Tata move. Are you sure, Papa? Hmm. Yeah. Papa, hmm. if that ever happens, my happiness will know no doubt. No. 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 <laughs> eh? I don't give me a ramu bet. Chikwe wire, maka, maka le buko ajo bubu maya wolf. Eh? If I buy wolf, le buko ajo bubu. Yes, papa. Eh? Chikwe wire. Okay, um, papa. I'm sure I can go down a cup full of flour. But Jikwe. let me just take this. Chikwe wire, maka maya wolf le buko ajo bubu. <laughs> Chara chara mu amu miara muku eh oh you okay na yeke lem dia 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 gadi yes come. Hey, so you even know my name? <sighs> Mazi, who doesn't know you in this kingdom? <laughs> yeah. You are Obinze. Yes, I'm Obinze, the son of Nana Okonkwo. Uh, no wonder. Uh, I knew your father. He was a good man, though he died young. My father was a very happy man. His name actually lives after him. He may have died young. But he did not die unfortunate. Uh, you, are, you are right. He wasn't a close friend. So since you knew him better, uh, it would be right for you to say such things about him. Uh, please, can you take a walk with me? Just, let's take a walk. With all pleasure, sir. Yes. <laughs> um, 
I gather that you were away for too long to your uh, um, maternal Ibunde. home. Yes, you're very correct. You gathered right. Yeah. Mm. Ikunne is actually close to my heart. Yes. Ikunne we bamba. Huh? It's a place of refuge. <laughs> Ikunne, I don't joke with it. E bamba. Mazi, I call you with Talu. I understand you have special feelings for your daughter and Kim. I have nothing against it. But my heart is with Oluchi. <laughs> uh, well, that is, there's no doubt about that. But I'm the father of the two madams. And I know them better than you do. I will advise you to take in Kim. Fire, fire, where, yeah, where. You will have my blessings. What you ask of me is not possible. Mazi, honestly speaking, your appeal for your daughter and Kim is very appalling. <laughs> um, well, I thought you said you knew me very well. Because if you knew me, you would grab this proposal with two hands. I know you very well. I'm Amgufuma. I know you like I know the back of my palm. What I don't understand is why you don't know or why you don't care to know who is standing in front of you. That in itself is not wisdom. <laughs> well, my son, um, I wouldn't want to bandy words with you or get into trouble with you because my favorite daughter's heart craves for you. I think I will give you time to think about it. Reconsider your stand. There won't be any need to think about it. I have made my choice, and that is final. So please, accept that. Go home. Caution your daughter in came to be of good behavior. God, <laughs> Well, a big head is only heavy if the neck is not strong. This is a task that must be done. This woman with heart of darkness, so powerful, he's so evil, he's so wicked, everybody beware. So, so it has reached the point where my father will join forces with my sister to destroy my happiness. The gods must have committed a huge blunder by making me a part of this family. You know what? Your plans will not work. How can the one I call my father stoop so low as to go to meet a young man to speak in favor of his stupid daughter to plead for a love she does not deserve? How? Are you not ashamed of yourself? Oluchi. Oluchi! How dare you stand before Papa to talk nonsense? How dare you? I will not have you cut me short when I still have words in my mouth. By the way, if I ever hear or see you close to Obinze again, I will put you in your place. Mama Ashere, so you have neither respect nor fear anymore that you can now stand in my presence and open your mouth in disrespect to me. Respect. You speak of respect. Do you deserve it? Do you deserve it? I'd rather respect a goat tied to a tree than respect you. You have done the unimaginable. What more can you do? What more can you do, I ask? Respect my foot. Olushi, do you think I will stand here and watch you talk to Papa like and that? And what will you do? Defender of her father. 
He came, I said, what will you do? If you dare come to my... I will strangle you to death. Torture! 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 She should have stood her ground. You watch me tear her in bits. Despicable souls. Why are you running now, Richie? Come back here and touch me! You think, I, you think I was, I'm scared of you? I am not scared of you, Aruchi! Come and touch me and see what I will do to you! Papa, leave me alone! No, it's okay. Leave me, Papa! Let her come out! It's okay. Don't worry. Don't worry yourself. Don't you make me Hey, she doesn't know me. Papa, warm her, oh! No, it's not my size, though! Papa, it's not my size, though! Papa, it's not my size, though! Papa, my size, though. Ha. Don't, you, don't you know what I can do? I know okay. what you can do, Papa. Oh. <laughs> we aren't in this house. Just relax. Eh? Relax. Relax. Sit down. Sit down. Ah, ah. Don't you trust me? <laughs> to stand on my way. <laughs> it's all right. <laughs> we shall see. <laughs> Just continue with what you were doing. Oluchi, I cannot believe that. That's why all you knew about Papa. You still had the guts to confront him. Holy child, are you out of your mind? Don't you fear for your life? Fear will bring me nothing but harm in this case. Yes. It is the love of my life we're talking about. The love of your life. Oluchi, hear yourself. You're talking about the love of your life. Can you hear yourself? Have you not considered my experience with Papa? Or have you forgotten so soon? I put everything into consideration. You were afraid of Papa and for your life and consequently lost the love of your life. But in this case, I am ready and willing to die for love. If Papa likes, let him do his worst. Hey! Oluchi! You must be out of your mind to think you're right in the way you're taking this matter. Don't you know who Papa is? Oluchi, you're my sister and I don't want anything to happen to you. Please! Reconsider your position in this matter. Oluchi, did you hear what I said? Oluchi! I said I heard you. Good. Good. I know you're my sister. And you will do exactly what I've said. Help me and prepare the soup. I want to go get something. I'll be right back. I'll do that. Good. I hope that good for nothing Chinasa does not come to this house again. <laughs> that one? She dares not. Imaro Nyambu, don't you trust your brother? She dares not. Mmm. Have you come out, so? I traveled far and wide to bring in my gods and across the river to acquire my powers. So my gods and I are one and exist to do my biddings. Arosine ebonya kaya de ocha. Ejimanya mabo. Naka mabo. Weli amuse. Eta amuse we broza akolom. Hewele! Obienze. The son of Nana, O Konkwo, I come for you. You seem to be a man of strong will, but it takes a man of courage to hold a cobra by the tail. So today, I'm sending my arrows to destroy your willpower and subjugate you to my wishes. Shut up, fuck up, Shimbamba!
I told you what I A wise man should know his boundary. Stop showing yourself to be foolish. Iga Harry Mary. I am not vulnerable to your wizardry. Stop performing your amateur witchcraft on me. Ogahaba. See, for all the cases that have come to my hearing, I choose not to listen to them. Because I am tired of begging and talking for you to spare me some respect before the people. But the issue of your involvement in our daughter's affair is out of it in mine. Is that of it? Eh? How could you segregate between your daughters? Even to the extent of supporting in Kem in the atrocity she wants to commit against her sister. How could you nine? No matter what you do outside, at least try to be a father to them. Try. Imamu, okay, boogie. Try and be a father to them. Woman. My heart is heavy with thoughts. So you should not bother me with thoughts about your children who are iti. Iti boribo. Do we be? I mean, they're of no use to me. They're useless. Eh? My children are useless. Is that what you're telling me? That my own children are of no use to you? Eh? Then you stop involving yourself in their personal affairs. Stop involving yourself in their personal affairs. Since you cannot play your role as a father to them, you stop! Stop it! Stop it! That's what I'm telling you, stop! How long have you been standing there? Um, not quite long, but I've been waiting for you to come out. Well, I'm here now. What is it? Adrian, please, I want you to consider what your father told you. Something tells me I'm your wife. It keeps telling me, it keeps reminding me, Nedu is your husband. Nedu is your husband. And I know that this thing cannot lie. Nedu, please. I am your wife. What's that your name again? My name is Chinasa, but my friends call me Chichi or Nasa. Chinasa, right? Or Chichi. Or Chichi. Now listen and listen good. I can never be your husband. I am not interested in you. So go back to the person who sent you to me and tell him I rejected you. He should find someone suitable for you. Because I am not interested. It's you that I want. It's who I want. Are you alright? Please leave this place at once. I'm not going anywhere. I'm not going anywhere. I want to grow old with you. I want to have children for you. I will die with you. I will do everything for you. What? Please, Are you alright? I'm fine. I'm fine. Okay, okay. You, you want me to love you by force? See, it's not by force. You will learn it. I will teach you. I will teach you. It comes from the inside. Please, please, please. Okay, <coughs> Chinasa, get up. Get up. Get up. It's alright. You want me to love you by force? <laughs> Chinasa. It's okay. Chichi. Chichi. Wait for me. Okay? Wait for me. I'll be right back. No, you should have stayed back. You want me to love you by force. My 
sister. <laughs> you run into me again today and sweat it as ever. <laughs> you must be coming from Nedu's house, I guess. How did you know? My sister, Nedu is the best man any woman will wish for in this kingdom. And I have him. <laughs> in fact, his potentials are very explosive. <laughs> Indeed. Yes, so. And that is why you always sweat. Mm. His love must be very strong. Did you say his love? No. Our love. In fact, we love each other that the gods of this land has even approved it. <laughs> mm. Yes, sir. Mm. I can see that. You are very lucky. I am happy for you, my friend. Did you say I am lucky? Mm -hmm. You get it wrong again. I am not lucky. We are happy. We are lucky to have each other. In yeah. fact, love is sweet, oh. <laughs> <laughs> my sister. Oh, dear, ma. Enjoy. Thank you. Uh -huh, my sister, mm -hmm. I pray that the gods of this land will give you a man like Nidu that will love you the way he loves you. <laughs> Let me run along, girl. Stop <laughs> He did not even look at my face. There was nothing I did not even do. It's as if he already hated me before he, he, he met me. I tried all my best. I turned my back. I did like this. He did not look at me. I did like this. He did not look at me. Papa, it's very painful. It's very painful. It's okay. Um, you can go now. There is something that is bothering me. And I wouldn't want to be disturbed now. As for helping you to get what you want, I will do that, but you have to go now. Uh, Papa, you have to love you because the way he's acting is acting as if you never. I said you can go now and come back later. Go! I don't want to be disturbed! I've been waiting for you to come, my daughter. I am sorry. I should have come before now. I know that my son has not spoken to you. But I still want to tell you that I'm sorry about the last time. Mama, you don't have to be sorry. Your worries are justified. Oh, thank you so much. Thank you for your understanding. I am so happy that my son found love in you. Thank you. Do you worry for his safety? Yes. I worry as well. But I pray to the gods daily that nothing, nothing whatsoever happens to the one I love. Please, my daughter. The safety of my son is in your hand. Take care of him. Let nothing happen to you, please. Wana to a ring, Kiki Kam Gabo, Mirionezo, Kiki Kam Gabo, Nakaemelu Mala, Mirizorezo Gawacha, Obimo. Okay, Dinjo. He's so powerful. He's so evil. He's so wicked. Everybody beware. Oh, 
Because of one man, I call you with a love. I hope this is not what I'm thinking. If it is, then Akuminiwe is a goddess worth avoiding. And if the young man you are talking about is her subject, then you need to tread carefully on the path you tread with your charms. But, but he's, he's only a boy. A little boy who does not even know why the manhood wears a cap. In the whole of my kingdom and beyond, nobody, nobody has ever resisted my spell. But he did not only resist my powers, he foiled it, dried it up, and threw it to my face. Agamib, Ademanaju. Akumenigwe, the goddess of sky, is devoid of evil and no one can harm a room with evil. I recall, in the time past, when my predecessor had an open confrontation with Ezenwai, the priestess of the goddess, he tried fighting her with black power, but she humbled him Ruined him beyond recognition. But Okunu is the champion of black powers. Arusini ebuonye mbondo na tu yuto. Arusini ebuonye akia docha. Okunu that controls the assemblage of powers. Are you saying that? There is a, 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 another power that is superior. I have not said that. The goddess of Akumiwe is the most invulnerable to evil power. No one can harm her own with evil. The goddess of the sky symbolizes the principle of see no evil, hear no evil, speak no evil and do no evil. Mm. Up to now, our subjects are protected under this great principle. But you know the deep things, including the things that are hidden from humans. I'm sure you know the secret of their powers, because none is invulnerable without a secret. I call you a teller. Power has no profit without wisdom. So the principle of wedding power lies in wisdom. And as I was saying, Agamib, Adem Manaju, I have nothing more to say. Decorum remains the reason crocodile chews slowly. Second, courage. Okudeli is like a son to me. Mama, I'm aware. And I know that Okudeli has been very close to Obinze right from childhood. Good. I am happy you know this. You see. Okudele is a nice man. Since you're about to be the wife, I want you to bring out the best in him. You know what I mean? I will. I know what you mean, Mama. Good. You're making me shy. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I will. I'll try my best. I'll try. That is my daughter speaking. Thank you, Mama. Thank you, Mama. I do not want you to think that your mother does not have your interest at hand. See, she has a fears. Okay? And I want you to consider her feelings and put things right. Okudili. Who is it? I understand my mother's fears. But I want you to put this into consideration. 
it is about me. It's about my happiness we're talking about here. Of course. No. Oluchi is a precious gift from the gods for me. Am I now supposed to forfeit it because of fear? <sighs> Obi is my good friend. You see, you sound so sure about this. <laughs> well, um, I'm happy for you. I'm very much happy for you. You see, I would love to meet her. Hmm. And officially invite her for a coming wedding. I'm sure Oluchi will be delighted to hear this. I told her a little about you and <laughs> really Uloma. Uh huh, yes. <laughs> it's fine. Wow. wow. So wow. you have nothing to worry about. <laughs> Good. Yeah. Good. No problem. Mm. Oloma is a beautiful girl. Sure, know? yeah. It's a beautiful lady. <laughs> have a big eye. <laughs> Wanna to a ring, Kegi Kamgabo, Mirionezo, Kegi Kamgabo. What? Please stop. Shy, shy, this is my love, shy. Don't worry, she has gotten used to getting such compliments. Well, I would say um, such compliments is well deserved in the form. Exactly. <laughs> I'm happy for you. I'm happy for you too. I pray that the gods will bless your union. Isi. Isi. <laughs> and I'm sure you both will be at our wedding. Michelle. My love, you don't have to wish for that. Of course, they will both be at our wedding. Isn't so? I will not miss the wedding for any reason. You see, you, it's not just you alone. Let me call it you on that. Mm -hmm. She also will have to miss it. I'm sure she will not miss it for anything. It will be my pleasure. Promise me you will come for the wedding, will you? Mm -hmm. I promise. shall be there. Good. Mm. Good. 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 So I guess that settles it, right? Yeah. Good. I said it. On that day. Wanna to a ring, keki kamgabo, mirionezo, keki kamgabo, nakae melumala. Obino, <laughs> Hey. I see you're struggling with the firewood. <laughs> you can say that again. What a pleasant surprise, my yes. brother. So good to see you. Is everything Same okay? Here. Yes, everything is alright. How is Oluchi? Oluchi is well. Okay. Ah. So you say all is well? My brother. There's no problem. I have come to discuss something very important with you. Okay then. I'm all ears. Oluchi told me about how my father confronted you and all his reasons for doing so. Obinze. My father is not a good man. As a matter of fact, he should be avoided at all costs. So my brother, I have come to advise you and also to tell you to please stay away from Oluchi and also stay away from my family. Obinze, do not see me as a bad person for this message I brought. For I swear by the gods, it is for your own good. Nedu, you've spoken well. And um, I appreciate your kind gesture. But I need you to understand something. Olichi and I have come to be. I know that it will be very hard for you to take my warning seriously. I understand. But I'm begging you. Please. 
try and stay away from man. All these things I've just told you are worthy of deliberation. I have thought about what you said, even before you came here. And honestly, I understand your fears. But there is absolutely nothing to be worried about. Okay. If you say so, I say so. Then I must take my leave. Farewell then. Thank you for coming. Hello, Fuma. <clears throat> Is Oluchi aware of your visit? Oh uh, no, she's not. And she does not need to know. She won't know. Good. See you later. Uona tuari mkeki kamgabo Mirionezo mkeki kamgabo Maka emelu mala mirizorezu gawata Obimo, obimo, uamo my son, I'm aware of the difficulties you're facing, but you must insist on what your heart wants. We all know my husband is a very difficult person, but I must give you my support. If Oluchi, my daughter, is the love you seek in my home, I will give you all the support you need. Thank you very much, Mama. Mama, I know with you we do not have any problem. Mm -hmm. Papa is still alive, and there's nothing we can do without his support. My daughter, your worry concerning your father is true. Seeing the steps he has already taken, but would rather give you my support than worry about him. The ghosts have their ways. Who knows? Before you know it, tomorrow he might change his mind. We are very hopeful. And there's no one in Sobo. Yeah. Hmm? We are very, very hopeful. I, I, I pray Papa changes his mind someday. Uh, uh, Mama, I, I have to take my leave right now. I will go back from here. Be cool, eh? Dalu Onna, greet your mother for me. I will, I will, certainly. Oh. Yeah. Oh. You're worried? Apuriche, look. I have seen more than you can ever imagine concerning the steps your father has taken. But I'm not bothered about it. You know why? Our love is of the gods. And I know the will of the gods shall stand. You don't need to worry. Bikunu. Anukum. I have heard. I love you. Richie. I love you more than words can ever express. Namojo kodo muonke kikamga buo Naka emelu mala Mirizorezu ga wata Obimo, obimo, uamo about to lose another son. Never! Not when I know I go here with that. Oh, Benze. Why don't you consider my pain? My fear? In your very eyes, I lost your brothers and father in the hands of the evil men of this land. I am the son of the goddess. 
The gods are on my side. Then take my advice as the one coming from the gods. Yes, I am not against your newfound love, but against the marriage. Why? Because he will not give you his blessings. You need his blessings in this marriage. The Akonye Wetaro that I know has only curse and evil to offer. Curse and evil have no power over me, Mama. My love to Oluchi has been predestinated by the gods. Oluchi deserves me and I deserve her too. I have seen that you have made up your mind. I want you to go and see my mother. I want her say in this matter. I will go and see her. I will be attending Okudili's wedding to Uloma, but that will be tomorrow. As for now, I need to go and check out my trap. I know you find my visit very surprising. Uh, I cannot deny that fact. <laughs> but I am very happy to have you in my house. <laughs> I can see that you are about going out when I came. And uh, I wouldn't want to stop you from going out. Please, this is a special meal I oh. made for you. Do not say no. I hope you will like it. Informa. Uh, thank you so much. I appreciate this. I am happy you accepted it. Mm. I mean, why, why won't I accept it? Coming from you? Of course. Thank you so much. <laughs> Don't mention. Well, I will be on my way. See you some other time. I would really love to see you again. Okay. Bye. 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 <coughs> Secrecy is the potency of all supernatural powers. Surugede is the dance of the spirit. I, Akonye Wetara, have perfected my move of the spirit. Imananka, Imankoza, no amount of vulnerability can withstand the powers from the shrine of Okulu. Nkem, Nkem, Anybody caressing the bottle of a fat woman is looking for what is not lost. Hmm, a man come right here. It is time for you to be useful. Come right here, my dear. Here. Good. Go over there. Kneel and close your eyes. Musharakata, Mushalawa, Krokoto, 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 Kombe. Shalakata, Mushalawa, 
Krokoto, 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 Kombe! You will drink from this and go and give to Ginze and then get me the pots. Kombe! You can now go. There is woman with heart of darkness. I call me with a no gay danger. So powerful, he's so evil, he's so wicked. Okay. Good afternoon. Good afternoon, the Panama. Are you waiting for someone? Yes. Who? I have been waiting for you. You've been waiting for me. Why? Uh, Obinze. Please, I'm sorry. I want you to know that I regretted my actions. I should have controlled my feelings and not let it put me to shame. Please. Do not despise me for ah, it. Uh, Kim, despise is such a strong word to use. I, I don't despise anybody. I've never despised anybody before. I understand the way you feel. And I'm also glad that you have realized that what you did is wrong. So it's fine. I have nothing against you. It's okay. Thank you for your understanding. Yeah, it's, it's okay. It's fine. Um, I want you to help me and plead with my sister. Let her know that I regret my actions. Okay, don't worry. I will talk to her. I'm very, very sure that um, Oluji will be glad to hear your voice. Yes. Um. I've never felt like this in a while. I think there's something strange, something bad, something traumatic is about to happen. And I don't seem to have the power to stop it. The goddess of the sky, the goddess of Akumuri Igwe, is about to reveal something to me. Where's the wine? You speak great words that I cannot understand. Tell me, what is happening? Mbafu, 
Yes, it's why. You served under me all your life. And now, the greatest task has come for you. Task? What task are you talking about? Go! Get me the maidens. Gather them for the ritual. Fakumuri Igwe is about to reveal something to me. Papa! 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 I did just as he told me. Good. I am your father. I can do all things. And none of my papers can fall to the ground. Now, come. Wana tu ari mkeki kamgabo Mirionezo mkeki kamgabo What is it? What is it? Again, what is it? What is wrong? Let me help you. Don't worry, don't worry. Let me help you. Don't worry, don't worry. Oh, what do you want me to do? I don't know, I feel very strange. You don't? really strange. Uh, something happened and then I felt strength leave me. Uh, it happened like a flash of light. Okay. S sorry. Uh, let's uh, go. Uh, I'm, I will, I'll see you off to the house. Let me help um, you. Bamba, happy, happy. Let me help Ask you. Okay, happy. I'm leave it. I will carry it. I got, okay. Are you sure? Namujo <laughs> There's nobody around to help me when I get up. Get up. Hey. Mm. Let me get the light. Oh, I can't put the bush in it. Oh. Please, who beans the colonel? Stand, please. Okay. okay. Please. Eh? Mm -hmm. She sent me to Big Obinze as a matter of urgency. She feels his life could be in danger. Mm, please, where is he? Obinze just went out to check his dog in the bush. So we have to get him immediately, please. We have to get him now, immediately, please. Okay, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Where is my soul? Where is my soul? Please, please, please. 
say my son? What is that? What is that? is that? What 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 is the forbidden Edo Mahabala, which turned him into a wizard with the most wicked heart he has today. All he has devoted to do is evil and sorcery. Though he knows the right to perform and be emancipated from the cause of the gods, but it seems he takes delight in performing evil. Uh, Mama, I've heard these stories about Papa countless times. Now I want us to tackle the situation at hand. Good that you can meet No, no. Our people say that if you come and me. I know Papa has obviously done evil to us, individually and collectively. But then what can we do? He's our father. And he plays the gods to make him our father. And we cannot question the gods. If Papa is shamed today, he deserves it. But it must not come from us, his family. We must do everything, everything our very best to protect him. Because that is what family is meant for. Yes. Family is supposed to be there for each other, to protect each other. Mm -hmm. I'm all in one name. What I'm saying is that you must not testify against Papa that he killed Ubinze. Biko. Yes. You saw him fire his rifle at Ubinze. And we believe he did it because we know what our father can do. But Biko, are you on the one name? Do not testify against him. I am Rock One Nozo. He is the only father we have. Biko. Nem. Nedu is right. I know that you are deeply hurt. But please, Biko Ne, save our family. Save us from this shame. Please. Please do not mention the past name. Mm. You know the consequences. <sighs> they will stone and bury him alive. Mm. Mm. Oluchi, please, no matter the offense, he is still your father. He is our father. Please, my sister, I beg you in the name of the cause of our land, be gone. Oh, 
Mkegi kangavo Makaemelu mala Mirizorezu gawata Obimo, obimo, uamo Nemu chukodomo Mkegi kangavo Namu chukodomo Mkegi kangavo Makaemelu mala Mirizorezu gawata Obimo, obimo, uamo Somebody is going to die today. Madiga Omo, my own father. Omamme, tell him. Wait for me, let's go before it's too late. Somebody is going to die today. Hold this right there. I demand you release him at once. I will not let you ruin my family's name with what you're about to do to my father. Nedu, your father brought this to himself. So you must not come between us and the judgment that awaits him. The duty of the youth is to execute the judgment. So you stay clear. Nonsense! Nonsense! How dare you! Look, I have not come here to bandy words with you. If you do not release him now, I will single-handedly destroy all of you! This is your last chance! I am Nadu! I am the son of my father! Who are you? Take him away! of us here, not the reason we are gathered. When our people, the ancestors of this land, were leaving us, they never left us void. They did not leave us without a direction. 
that left behind with us the rich cultural and religious heritage. Also the left sanctity and discipline. Also the left behind for us a code of conduct and judgment that will enable us say that the sanctity and discipline left with us is maintained or rather are maintained in our land. We all know that murder is a heinous crime. It's a taboo. It's an abomination that makes any ear that hears it say to fear for. We all know the penalty. But we do not apportion judgment without a witness or an evidence of the crime committed. Therefore, here in our midst, is our chief priest. Also here is a witness. According to our tradition, she must hold the staff of Ogugu in her hand to swear and make a declaration before all of us gathered here, before our ancestors and before the gods of our land. That whatever she will swear here today shall be the truth and nothing but the truth. Chief Rist. I am Boladia Fuge. Oh, no, 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 My daughter, here is a star of Okobubu. My daughter, step forward and swear before it. by the gods of our land that my father Akonyo Wetalo shot and killed Obinze in my presence. Hey. Hey. Thank you, my daughter. You have proven that you are truly the daughter of the soil. We are grateful. The evidence has been proven, and we have nothing to doubt it anymore. Mm. We have to do what we can to avert the wrath of the gods from us. The youths, you have to take Akonya Wetalo far beyond the bounds of our land. And there, execute the judgment on him, so that the wrath of the gods will be averted from us. Our land will be blessed and sanctified, purified, and we shall have no cause again. <laughs> Open 
cherry, 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 please. Don't run. Oh, my. 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 Really? Yes. Uh, um, please, um, uh, where are they now? They are the bandit of the kingdom right now. Bandit of the kingdom? Yes. Because Kaiga. Kaiga. Namuju kodomu onke kikam gamu o Naka emelu mala Mirizo rezu ga wata Obimu, obimu, uamu Oluchi, 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 oh, oh, Oluchi. We saw Obinze. I think he's alive. What are you saying? Obinze is lying in his grave. He's alive. No, we saw Obinze, flesh and blood. He's alive. We saw him together now. He's alive. Yes, he's yes. alive. Obinze is alive. Oh. Obinze. Wanna to hurry? Do it. This woman with heart of darkness, I call no better, no danger. Is that you? It's me, I'm alive. Is that you? It's me. Because I saw him lying dead. Let me find him. I'm alive. Hey! He said I didn't do it. I'm alive. I'm alive. I'm alive. I'm Heart of darkness, I call me a waiter, no gay danger. He's so powerful, he's so evil, he's so wicked. Everybody beware. Wanna to hurry, Kiki Kanga. So, my daughter, does it mean that the testimony you made before the people here was not true? No, Igwe. I am shocked as well as confused. I, I saw my father kill Obinze. We took his body. We, I saw his grave. I am, I'm confused. Igwe, her testimony is true. Everything is still confusing to me. But I thank the gods that I'm still alive. Young man, tell us what happened. You are not supposed to be alive. You are supposed to be dead. Wise huh? one. My life is a mystery. I honestly don't know what happened. 
I just realized that when I woke up, I found myself alive. I asked my friend what happened and then he, he told me everything that happened. Hey! Hey! Oh, Timo! Hey! 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 So my mother is no more! 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 Hey! Hey! God is for for your life. <laughs> Whose grave is that? Hmm? Why is everyone quiet? I asked the question. Whose grave is that? <laughs> Open the <door. laughs> Whose grave is that? Look, I hope Oluchi is fine. Mama? Mm -hmm. Is Oluchi okay? Mm -hmm. That grave was meant to be yours. If not for the providence of the goddess of Akimiyegui and for the benevolence of the priestess of the goddess. I need to sit and rest. I don't need rest. Obinze. Sit. I don't need rest. What I need right now is to know whose grave is that. Well, um, there was nothing meant to be a secret for me. This is what happened. <laughs> Something strange is about to happen. Something traumatic. This may be the last time that you will see me. But whatever happens, know that my spirit will remain with you. He has come. What's the one you see? My son. Yesterday, a critical call came to me from the shrine of the goddess, Akimiligwe, and I had come immediately to get you. I abandoned my marriage plan with my wife-to-be because of the urgency of the message. Unfortunately, on getting to see you, it was already late because we could not beat the time to come early enough. But then, as a wine instruction was to bring you dead or alive to her as soon as possible. But then, according to the instruction I received from Ezewaya, if we happen to meet you dead, we must bring you in a secret of every member of the land, and so to confuse everyone with dog a grave before their very eyes. <laughs> so to keep the instruction of the Ezewaya, we had to wait until evening when everyone is gone, and we hurried and covered the grave to create the impression that you were buried. And so in secret we moved your body when no one was there and went through the bush paths and out of the praying eyes of anyone. And through the night we labored to take your body to Ezewain as she commanded. Eventually we got to the shrine late in the night and it looked like the priestess had exhausted her options 
and so she ordered that your body be taken into the shrine. I waited for so long while there is a wire and a maiden performed the ritual in the shrine. Then in my slumber, I woke up to see you walking. It was indeed sight beyond belief. As a wire made a life sacrifice to restore your breath and give life to your body, and so consequently, she lives no more. So we brought you back home in the night while everyone was asleep. I wish you had done as commanded by the priestess in the last instruction given to us by the senior maiden who took the mantle from her. That was all that happened. And we are grateful to the gods. Now you have your life and your breath again. <laughs> the destinies of the gods. And you must not mourn how we give you life. Because that was our instructions. <laughs> my good friend. It pleases the gods to put my life in your hand and also deliver me from the cold hands of death. I am most grateful. You're welcome. My son, Mama, send my regards to your betrothed. Hmm? We'll visit very soon to celebrate your marriage. Hmm? She'll be glad to hear that. Mama. <laughs> Good. I want to also apologize for all the inconveniences I must have caused you. Please, tell Uloma that I will come personally to tender my sincere apologies for ruining her day. Uloma, my wife, is a woman of understanding. Mm. She would rather be happy, you are alive and strong again. We have to go now. Please remember, you must not mourn the life you live. Because the life you live is our death. Stay away, my friend. Go well, my brother. Thank you. Go well. Thank you very much. Mama. My son. Thank you. Go well, eh? Thank May you. the gods guide you. Thank you, Mom. Go well, son. Thank you, Mom. What is it, son? You don't have to blame yourself for what happened. I must see Oluchi now. I forbid you to say that. You must not say it. What? My mother. If Ezewan is dying wishes, I do not mourn her. 
doesn't it mean that I need to continue in the pursuit of my heart desires? No! No! Don't! I must. Please don't. Don't. Wanna to worry, keki kam gabo, mirionezo, keki kam gabo. So you see, I died, but um, my life was restored to me by my grandmother. Yes, yes. the goddess of Akimirigwe. The goddess of the sky. She gave her life in exchange for mine. This is a mystery. Quite unbelievable. I know there's a one. Does it mean that you are the son of a goddess? Yes, wise one. Hi. So, what will be the fate of Akonya Wetaro now? Um, Igwe, if you would permit me to speak in this matter, I would like to say that we should please spare his life. Yes, the gods restored my life. So let us leave justice in the hands of the gods. For you, Oluchi, I will never forgive you for what you did. Never! Nedu, I do not understand why you are angry with me. Your father shot me with his gun and wanted me dead. Did I not warn you? I warned you to stay away from my family, did I not? Nedu, what has come over you? Nedu, you have lost your sense of reasoning. Why are you allowing your heart to boil over in anger? You should blame Papa and not us. Oluchi, I don't have time to banter words with you. I have saved my mind. Stay away from my family and never ever cross our path again. I swear the gods bear me witness I will do something nasty if you ever cross my family again. <laughs> now leave my house at once. Leave before I do something nasty. Need Why are you going to with that much clothes? I have to go and mourn my mother. I know I have caused you and your family a lot of grief and sadness. I know you're angry with me too. I believe your anger is justified. But please, don't hate me for what happened. At least let us thank the gods for restoring his life. Be gone me. Don't be too upset with me, oh? You will drink from this and go and give to Ginze and then get me the box. 
Ombe. not to kill him. That was a step too far. You had a wish. Yes! I wanted Obinze's love and not his life. To what use would his death have been to me? Your wish is inferior to mine. Obinze dead me and nobody does that. Papa, Obinze does not deserve to die. To think that you used me to achieve your devilish motive. That is not fair to me. Your heart desire is no more important to me. Obi is a challenged me, and that made him my enemy. And the war between daughter and father is about to start. <laughs> Meet me for what? Listen, the only place where yes means no is in the latrine. I don't have time for your nonsense. If you know what is good for you, just get out of my sight. I'm not going anywhere. I'm not going anywhere. You promised that you will bring Nedu and I together, that uh, Nedu will marry me. I'm not going anywhere. Oh. No man in this kingdom has touched me. Nobody has even been my body. I kept myself for my Nedu, for my husband. And you're telling me that I should go. I'm not going anywhere. Do you know the issue that I'm making in this kingdom because of Nedu? I'm not going. If I sleep, it's Nedu I see. If I dream, it's Nedu I see. He's my husband, though, and I must marry him. I now know that you are, you are mad. <laughs> Raven, mad. Look, look, look. I don't have time for rotten mangoes. If you don't get out of my sight now, eh? I'm not good anyway. 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 Look at her! Will you get out of my sight before? <laughs> <laughs> Good afternoon. Good afternoon. Hmm. What happened? I have been waiting for you. You still remember our last discussion? Where I told you my thoughts towards you. Please respond to my proposal. Hmm. Nedu. <laughs> what proposal are you talking about? <laughs> I can't remember. Uh, I feel. Don't tell me you've already forgotten what we discussed about. When I told you I want to marry you, and you said you were going to think about it, have you forgotten? So, you still think about that? After the evil your father committed in our land? You mean, you still expect me, Ifoma, to marry you, and then get myself in the nest of your evil family? No, 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 no. I am still talking. Wait, I'm not done. No. I think 
I am wise enough to know what is not good for me. Nedu, I am not getting married to you. And that is final. Before, please, don't ever stop me. In fact, this should be your first and last time you will ever stop me. Evil family. Ifoma. Please, get out of my way. I will not be allowed to see all of you join in marriage with that God forsaken boy called Obinze. Never! Woman man! Not after all the shame and humiliation he brought to us. You must give me! Eh? Only she's punishment awaits her. My bitterness with Tobin has gotten to the brim that I do not wish to see him anywhere close to my sister again. If I see him close to Oluchi, Mbenye, Mbesaya, I'm sounding this warning just in case any of you think otherwise. Papa, I am going to fight Tobin I am going to fight him. And if the God saved his life the last time by restoring his breath, this time they cannot save him from my fury. Yes. Now I know I have a son, a true son of his father, a progeny of a progenitor. Eme Anyimele, Aga Anyara. Emele. Ne mo chuko do mo kegi kambabo. Our love is full of sorrows and troubles. It appears as if the gods are not on our side. A lot has happened to us since we came together. What should bring us peace and joy has brought us nothing but agony and restlessness. Of oh, the truth, my love, it would have bothered me if we did not go through such hard times. My love, you must understand and accept that trials and tribulations at the vivid signs of true love. It is too much. It's not too much for what we share. The gods are on our side. I promise I will keep you safe, happy for the rest of our lives. If the gods could give you back your life, it only means that we're destined for one another. from us. How did you find us? Yeah? I hope you were not trailing us. Obinze. Please forgive me. I was used to by my father. What did you say? You did not know that you defiled my spirit and made me vulnerable. Is that what you're telling me? I was this great to have you as my wife. But I could. 
could never have planned to kill you. I was sent by my father. And I thought it was for my good. I never knew he had plans. Please go please. Please forgive me. Inkem, you of all people should know who Papa is. Why did you conspire with him against us? Why? I lost my mind to greed and selfishness. I have not been a good person. Please forgive me. I never wanted him dead. I never wanted him. no grudges against you, but it's a good thing that you apologized. Hey, hey, stop there. Where are you coming from? I went to the riverside to check on the garden egg we planted there. The dog knows the owner. The owner knows the dog. You are becoming strange to me. Very strange. Papa, I do not understand what you are talking about. Afagefula, Afamefula, Kegefuna, Konyeji, you say you can hear a macaraka Momo, and I forgot for any. He meant my nap over on, he meant Yashina Gemar Shaki. It's a pity, my daughter, that knowing that your father does not take it easy with his enemies. Yet you chose to stand on my way. How foolish of you to stand with those who stand against me. The simplest thing I do to my enemies is to get rid of them. And since you have become my enemy, tonight you will sleep and work no more. Die! <laughs> <laughs>
What a pleasant surprise. <laughs> That's a nice abode you have for yourself. Thank you, Papa. <laughs> I know you... You are surprised with my visit. But I'm your father. So it's not supposed to be so. Um, as my first son, you should not have even left my OB. But be that as it may, I have nothing against you having your own board. Thank you, Papa. I appreciate your indulgence. Good. My son, I have a confession to make. I'm listening. You see, I've always had opportunity of destroying your life. This is because I felt that um, you had an inclination to cowardice. But I reconsidered my stand for two reasons. One, because you are the heir to my inheritance. Two is that I believed that one day you will reconsider your steps as a coward. Recently, your actions have proven that the cowardly spirit has left you. <laughs> Papa, thank you very much. But I've never been a coward. <laughs> I've been a strong man just like you. I'm a lion. Well, you, you can say that, but all I'm saying is that I'm now proud of you as a son. And uh, I want you to continue in that trail. I will, Papa. And if it's about Obinze, Papa, don't worry. I will take care of him. You can leave that to me. He will never marry my sister. And if he persists, Papa, I will destroy him. Good. You are a true son of your father. You know, in this land, everybody fears and nobody dares cross my path. That's true. I want you to take that example. I will, Papa. You see, recently I have learned that it's better to be feared and hated than to be loved and despised. I may look like mother, but I have your heart. You are a true son of your father. Thank you, Papa. Hmm? Thank you. Yes. You have Let said me. it all. Let me add more wine. Mama, you call? Yes. Please sit. Nkem's death is a very big blow to our family. The pain still lingers in my heart. Now, you are the only woman I have who can take care of me at my old age. But you need to understand that you must stop seeing Obinze. Yes, we have a bad history with him. He brought us shame and disgrace. Therefore, you must not marry him. Mama, please stop. If there's anybody that has brought this family shame and disgrace, it is Papa and not Obinze. If you're trying to stop me from marrying him as punishment for testifying against Papa, Mama, please try another punishment because as long as the gods will it, I will marry Obinze. Oluchi! Oluchi! Stop being stubborn! I am your mother. You have to listen to me. You have a family you come from. You have to listen to their instructions. Which family? This family? A family that sees evil and calls it good? Calls good evil? Eh? 
I will not be associated with it, let alone belong to it. Oluchi, come back here! Oluchi! This idiot is what it takes to stop seeing him around. Then I'm ready to kill him and face the consequences. Onyekabu! Onyekabu! What is wrong with you? Eh? Look, let me tell you, if you must emulate anybody, let it not be Papa. Because if you continue like this, what awaits Papa will await you. Hey! Hey! Don't you see what you've done? I don't have time for you, Oluchi. You're such a shame. How can you choose this man over and above your family? I don't have time for you. And as for you, today I will leave you with a broken head. But tomorrow, <laughs> you might not be so lucky. Stay away from my family. Stay away from my sister and everybody will have peace. I warned you. Lady, you're a coward. You're a coward. You're fighting who you know will not respond. You know your enemy. Go and fight him. Stop being afraid. Olohomo. Let's go. Hey. Ma. 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 What? Mama, no, Mama, don't start crying. Let me just sit down. Don't start crying. I didn't call you here to start crying, please. visit calls for surprise. I am curious, but I have to welcome you to my humble abode where nobody is a stranger. You are welcome. Hey! Your silence is ominous. Is there any, any problem? I heard what happened to you. How you were condemned to death by your community for murder. <laughs> uh, well, if you are talking about the last occurrence in the land, it's, uh, it's a forgotten issue now. It's a bygone and forgotten. I've always known you to be a stubborn man. This time, your stubbornness had become outrageous. The problem with you is not the power that you wear, but Edo Mawara, which you ate in the forest. 
hand, received the devilish and wicked heart from Amosu Kingdom. I have warned you before, and now I'm warning you again. Go to Gubu Shrine and perform the necessary ritual to get rid of Edo Maba and free yourself from the causes of the gods that are following you. <laughs> um, DBK, my friend, you know that Akonye Wetaro does not go to any other Dibia or shrine for whatsoever reason. Even the chief priest of Ogugu you mentioned, he is not a match to me. Then concerning the Edo Maba, yes, I ate it. And I did it wholeheartedly. Nobody forced me to eat the forbidden seed. And as such, I wouldn't want anybody to tell me to get rid of it. The stubborn fly ends in the grave with the corpse. Do not be that stubborn fly. You have beaten more than you can chew. No mortar by wedding power can become immortal. We are friends now. DBK left in this manner. I hope all is well. What message did he bring? Huh? What? Look, woman, you have to be sure of the question you ask me and stop bothering me with irrelevant questions. And as for the message he brought, what is your business with that? Huh? Will you go and get my lunch ready? I've been starving while waiting for your return from the market. And you are here asking me frivolous questions. I don't have time for rotten mango. I know he must have come to warn you concerning the Edo Maba. You have to reconsider our God before the ritual. <laughs> Uh, I want to go and see Okudili and his wife. It's all right, but must she go with you? Well, she insisted she wants to go with me, and I granted her request. Your people are there aware that you are living with him? Uh, no, my mother is aware. Mama, um, I will be away for a few days. Okay? Stay well. I will. Just go safely, eh? Next time I'm going to get the pizza for you. No. Look at your face. <laughs> My good friend, no good. Ah, you see? Ah! What is it? I'm so, I'm so, I'm so, I'm so happy. I'm so happy. Oh, <laughs> same here, same here. What is it? Thank you so much. You're welcome. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. You're welcome. Thank Did you have seats? Yes, yeah. you're welcome. Thank you. Uh, have seats. Have seats. Have seats. Have seats. Have seats. Have seats. Hey. Mm -hmm. What a visit. Yes, yeah, so um, we should have been here <coughs> a long time. Okay, so I want to apologize for coming late. Uh, no problem. Apology accepted. Thank you very much, Inne. We heard what happened to you. Hmm. We thank the gods you survived us. Indeed. The gods are kind. Very kind. Hmm? Please, please, Ankem. We need to offer them cola. Okay? 
Indeed, um, <clears throat> this is an honorable visit. Very honorable. Mm? I'm very so much. happy. I am. I am happy too. <laughs> so happy. So, Thank you very much. What is that? That you? <laughs> okay, it's been a long time. It's been a very long time. Let me first apologize for not attending your traditional marriage rites. Very well. Please, I am very really very sorry. Well. See, as a matter of fact, you came at the right time. Really? I'm with the right company. Hmm? See, usual. we have a lot. Eh? Now let's start with this. Eh? Thank you very much. Uh, Obisa! Eh? I've missed you, I've missed you. I've missed I know you, you like this kind of, this kind uh, of you one. You know now, nah, you know this me. This is the fresh one. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so Obisa. much. Obisa! Hey. hey, start with this one. Okay. Mm. Mama! Mama, where are you? I'm here. Uh -huh. What happened? Why are you raising your voice? Woman, where is your daughter? She said she will be away for a few days. Eh? Yes. So you mean only she did not sleep in this house last night? No. Hey! I, I, I tried to stop her. But she has grown white and stubborn. Even I can want to see a man. And did you I tell did. Papa about this? I did not. So but she is now Enzo Nyagwalam. So she has run away with a man when her bride price has not been paid. This is serious. Oh, we for a coordinate. Oh, we for a coordinate. Papa! You beg your meta! I'm coming. You have to stop him. And I'm a GB in Sierra Leone, man. Hey, say. Hey! My friend, true love is born out of pains and sufferings. But the end comes with a new beginning and fulfillment. You've spoken very well, my friend. And surely it is the way it is. It is well. I am not worried. The gods are on my side. It is indeed well. Thank you very much for your words and they were well received. You're welcome. Operator. I want to take a walk around the land. Okay, do you want me to come with you? No, I don't need you to come with me. I'll be back anytime soon. Okay. Take care of you. So well done. Run for me. Okay. He fled with my sister Oluchi against our will. I have come to pay him back for all his insults on my family's name. They are not here. They are not here. They are not here. Eh? Oluchi told me that. What is we of our about? Nonsense! Look, woman, don't you provoke me. Your stupid son Obinze is an animal. He has dared me. And I have come to pay him back. Hey, please. Please. Please don't be angry. Don't be angry with him. I will, I will, I will come with him to, to apologize on his behalf. No way. I must leave him back so that when he comes back, he will feel my presence. What? Yes. What do you want to do? What do you want to do? What, what do you want to do? I'm pulling down your Please, please don't do that. Please, I beg you. I beg you. Don't. Ah. Between you want, right? Huh? I'm here. How huh? dare you? How dare you show up to my face? Look what happened. Baby, you don't have to bring down my house or threaten my mother to make your point. You've allowed your father to influence you. How dare you insult my father in my presence? Huh? How dare you? Please, please. I am going to kill you and bear all the consequences. No, 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 no. I tell you, even with that gun pointed at me, you still cannot shoot. What? Get ready to die! No, no! Huh? Just 
do? What was that? Mama, I did nothing but put fear in him so he can end his rascality. You'll be fine. Oh, uh, no. Hey, what is it? Hey, who's after you? Papa, it's Obin. Papa, that boy has a strange spirit. If he fell for. It would do. Would do. That's what you are. Hey, because of that little boy, you, 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 have, you have fidgeted him. Sweating, sweating like a baboon. I'm disappointed in you. You're a disappointment to my lineage. Now is that, is that... Shut, 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 shut that mouth. You, that, that latrine, you, you, you come out. Hey! You just have to come back, okay? I know very well he's gonna come back. I know, I know. He's not missing me. Oh. God, what happened? Where did you go? You got me worried. I'm really sorry. I did not mean to take too long. We could have been here. Who means it? Where have you been? I'm sorry I cannot tell you. It's personal business. No problem. As well. One minute. We have to leave right now. We need to go and settle the differences between our family. I don't intend to do that. When we get to that bridge, I'll cross it. Yes, please, I would like you to stay longer. Uh, no. Yeah, I'm please. afraid, I'm afraid we cannot do that. We have to leave. It's very important to leave now. Please bring my luggage. <coughs> if you insist, let me down here. It is well. Uh, who means it? I don't know if I could be of any help to you. Um, not at all. The one you've done already is too much. Thanks so much for your hospitality. You're very sure? I'm very sure. Okay, you're welcome. Sure. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Thank you so much. Who is there? Who is there? Who is there? Who is there? It's well. Thank you okay. so much. It's well. Well. You're welcome. Yeah. You're welcome. Yeah. 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 Be safe, okay? Of darkness, I call me a wet alone. No gay danger, he's so powerful, he's so evil, he's so wicked. Everybody beware. See the jello mozi, come see cho. I have the ancient power of Amusu and the great power of Okulu. <laughs> Today. I shall put to an end the life of that stubborn.
stubborn boy who has refused to fall. Darkness moves over the night. Ukulu moves over the evil power. <laughs> I will destroy you. Tell me, how do you intend to face my family, especially my father? And which you worry too much. When we get to that bridge, we will cross it. It's not as if I don't believe you, but I'm just afraid. Afraid of what? Afraid of your father, right? And I'm telling you, I will handle it. Let's go. Smile for me. Oh. Show yourself now! Show yourself and stop being a coward! Surely you seem to be a man of strong mind and special chi. But he needs a man of special courage to hold a cobra by the tail. Akonye Wetalo. And it also needs an immortal being to hold a fight with me and succeed. Akonye Wetalo. You must not harm yourself by fighting me. Calm down, Woluchi. You must not harm yourself by fighting me. Evil has no power over me. You tried the last time and you succeeded. But I promise you, you will not succeed this time. I know your secrets. You are the son of the goddess. But you're also human. And with that, you are vulnerable to my powers. Akonye Wetalo. Spare your life now. And leave here this minute. Even Akamiligwe, the goddess of the sky, will not be able to save you today. And the witness, that your witness, will not be alive. Again, the witness against me before the Igwe and the community this time. There would not be any need for a witness. Akoya Wetalo! Akoya Wetalo! Akoya Wetalo! Live here at once! We shall see. Obi! Hey! Obi, say please. <laughs> Your life is in my hands, and I shall destroy you today. Akonye Wetalo, I warn you for the last time, do not end your life by yourself. It is in your hand to decide your fate. Obinze. See no evil, hear no evil. Obinze. Obinze, please. Obinze, please. Obinze, please. I call you with a little kid, yes, sir. Obinze, please keep quiet. Obinze, what are you doing? Oh, Obinze. Oh, 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 oh,
Obise! 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 What did you do? You're not hurt. What, what happened? What did you do? How come you're not hurt? I can never be hurt. Not ever again. Woman with heart of darkness, a corner with a no danger. He's so powerful, he's so evil, he's so wicked. Everybody, apologize for all my evil manners towards you. I was truly out of my mind. It's well, my brother. It's, it's okay. I have no grudges against you. And I'm happy we're on talking terms. You're welcome. It's well. Let me talk to Mama. Okay. Mama. My son. No. No. I'm so sorry, Mama. You're welcome, no? Mama, mama, I'm so sorry for the loss. Thank you, my son. Thank you. What can I say? I call you with a little girl here. I have nothing to say again. And I have decided not to mourn him. I suggest everybody does the same. Hey, be a If I should ask, 
When are you coming to ask for my sister's hand in marriage? <laughs> <laughs> Very soon. Ah. Yes, I cannot wait to make Oluchi my bride. Oh. Did you hear what he said? Hmm? I am not my Operation. Kam gabo mirionezo kegi kam gabo makae melu mala mirizorezo gabwata obimo obimo uamo nemu jukodo mo kegi kam gabo. Namu jukodo muong keki kamga bu. Nakae melu mala mirizore zuga wacha. 